very driven artist. I was born and raised until I was 18 years old in Cuba, Pinar del Rio. A quiet standing there place on earth. Growing up there, a good piece of my life was probably what turned me into this wild, creative, and profound person that I am nowadays. Cuba is a place where time stood still somehow. I don't know, there's, there's something quite liberating about that. There I learned more the daily companionship of survival that patience and discipline are wise components to a successful day. That the greatest fortune that we own is our lives, our lives. Cuba is also a very haunting and mystical place. It seems so forgotten to the rest of the world to see. But therefore, it carries these overwhelming energies hidden in that sea. They just so happen to radiate from the mountains, the forest, the winds, and the seas. I fell in the time hole as I followed this white man.
beauty that makes us human. They're nice of the people. And so captivate in order to from life, from self and social observations and studies. I research all around the human For the moment, I really like how my studio is in my flat. Um, this allows me to quickly work when I have an idea or if I want to revise something again. The only inconvenience about that is that I don't know how to separate my working time from my time. Life time is short, but not for lovers, respect that side. Because I'm really very impatient. I usually start with my oil color palette. That way I can place the main foundation on the canvas that I will later use. Topics of which nature even I was aware of at first. I work with acrylic a lot and I might keep on doing that sometimes. But right now I really do like to work with oil colors. Till now, it has been figurative, expressionist, realism. I like to think of it as a rather narrative, lucid dream style. I'm getting a taste right now of abstract, figurative expressionism. And I'm a fellow on that line for now. It seems to me to be more free from firm concepts and figures. This one right here. I paint because I do generally art because I feel that is the only way of living that's closer to freedom. Experiment with the ant when you 
draw a circle around her and she will understand that as a boundary and now moving forward you know, without trespassing the land. I am not this aunt and neither are you. So